George, that was a, a, a characteristically spectacular talk. We had heard uh, all the great things, and now uh, you've uh, uh, proven uh, everyone correct and, uh, and then some. So congratulations. That was super fun. Well, thank you very much. I, Thanks. I mean, I, I, this is a topic near and dear to my heart, well, and uh, uh, the more I can do, uh, the better. Well, look, you know, um, a, a big part of the, this uh, Innovator Series is, is to try to bring disparate people together to be talking about really the, the thing that gets them uh, the most excited. You and what you're doing at HTE is, uh, is really um, making the secret sauce or the kind of the basis uh, kind of uh, a soup stock for that, you know, for that innovation, you know, yeah. across the whole academy, yeah. right, and be, and beyond. The auger plate, the auger yeah. plate, the, uh, nice the blue one. The I was thinking one. more of a food thing, yeah. and you were thinking more of a lab thing. Exactly. So exactly. God bless you. That's why we're like the bookend. Kind exactly. Of things, right? <laughs> yeah. you know, but bottom line is, I, I, look, we have a saying as well that you know hard things are hard. W what's been? This has now been five years, right? And uh, and what what have been the uh, the seminal uh, surprises that you've seen? Terms of both successes and failures with, uh, with with HD, and how do you how do you keep the enthusiasm going? Well, I think with I mean the the main thing is the program's small, and so I can get a real sort of sense of the individuals that are coming in, and um, just make sure that how I'm interacting is in a way that brings them out and keeps them connected and keeps them juiced because. As I was describing, this is after a full day of medical school for the medical students, um, making sure that they've done all their lab experiments for the PhD students, and then there's another class, right? So the way to do it is bring lively speakers like you. You'll be there next year. Well, in the absence, <laughs> uh, in the absence of talent, lively is all that gets you through, FYI. That's right. Well, this is Hollywood where there's, <laughs> there's a, a bit of both, right? So. Uh, yeah, and uh, and it's crochet. and and the, and the students <laughs> really <Crochet>. expect it. <laughs> crochet, crochet, um, and uh, we really it, it, it we've had that's the other thing here at UFC. I mean, he, uh, there's such an amazing group of people who are fans of the program that it's very easy for me to invite them in, and they keep asking me when do I get to come back and then interact with your students. That's that's what I I love to hear the most. Well, uh, consider us both uh, avid, avid fans. <laughs> well, I know Greg. Greg yeah. uh, has been uh, more than he probably would have predicted at the very beginning, too. Yeah. So. Yeah. But definitely. So I think one of the things that um, was the, one of the learning points at Stanford was that and I think you're right that having students involved provides the energy and the enthusiasm, which is fantastic. And there's definitely economies of scale, like in terms of having. I was one of the TAs for the student course uh, at Stanford where... Uh, for the student undergraduate course. No, no, for the graduate course. For the graduate. For the graduate course. And so that was co-listed within engineering, medicine, and and uh, business. And it was actually on the business school campus. Yes. Um, but beyond just that, it was involving the greater community at large who was interested. So all of the entrepreneurs, the uh, venture capitalists, and that actually exists here in LA as well. Um, maybe not as, quite as concentrated, but how do you think it'd be possible to involve that greater community in HTE to kind of get it to grow? I think uh, what we've been doing so far is uh, also through the Coulter Translational Fund is to broaden the sort of scope of where the students are presenting. And I, in presenting with you guys, emphasize the internal competitions. Right. But there are external groups like SoCal Bio. Uh, Pasadena Angels, Tech Coast Angels, right. that you can get the students out there. And then uh, when I'm out there, or when the students are out there, or both, um, I can invite them back, right? right? So we do have these talks, and occasionally we'll have bigger sort of open events. And even the, you know, the, the student classes, I've invited other project teams, and I, you know, it's a great idea that, you, you know, to invite other external partners as well. Not They don't have to be formal partners, but just people who are interested in, you know, seeing what's going on. Yeah. yeah. So making the boundaries uh, open to other stakeholders that, and advisors and potential mentors like that, and people who say, you know, there, there's, uh, you know, here's from my experience, you know, they can contribute right live in class. Yeah, I don't think you're right. I think that doesn't have to be a, a formal relationship to start, because you just want to create the energy and the vibe that, like, everyone wants to be part of this. And I think, you start off by 
inviting people and they want to interact with the students. Yeah. The students want to interact with them and then the entrepreneurs from around want to be part of it and, and then when it becomes bigger like that, then the entrepreneurs want to meet the venture capitalists who are all part of it and then it just becomes a hub. Yeah. And I think that's kind of to me what was the special sauce at Stanford that made it work. It was just that everyone in the community wanted to be there yeah. and be part of it. Yeah. That's, that's and then that's when the money starts to flow in. <laughs> Yeah, uh, it, it, it sort of, you know, it, it, uh, it starts its own sort of uh, uh, chain reaction. Exactly. Right? And then it becomes a, a fissile material. No, right? exactly. It's a, it's a, a, a fusion, uh, fusion <laughs> process, exactly. There you are. Well, yeah, uh, fission or fusion. It'll fizzle out or it's going to fuse. And sometimes confusing. Well not done. Not, 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 oh, not, welcome not, to the not, club. Not. That just happened. <laughs> oh, that is terrific. <laughs> on that, uh, yeah, on that explosive note, uh, I, I, we we couldn't uh, have been more thrilled uh, to have you. And this was just so exciting. Look, man, here's to making a difference, and here's to uh, engaging bright young minds uh, into the ideas of uh, tomorrow. For real, this was great. Absolutely. Thanks very much for coming. All right.